Hi, Bill from CJ Pony Parts. The map pockets might be one of the most poorly designed parts on your Fox Body Mustang. These things can barely hold a registration car, let alone a map. Any kind of weight, they're going to sag and they're eventually going to rip. If you like the look of the map pockets and are okay with their limitations, TMI offers these replacement pockets available in all your factory colors. If you prefer a cleaner look, they offer these map pocket deletes, which are going to be installing in this 1990 Mustang GT. For this installation, you'll need a Phillips head screwdriver, quarter inch ratchet, short extension, 3 8 socket, door panel removal tool, a small pick, and a flathead screwdriver. Here's your typical factory map pocket. You'll see it's sagged in the back here. The front's so far down it's actually underneath the door. Ripped completely through. The rest of our desirable black interior is in pretty good shape, so we're going to replace these with a set of our deletes. Replacing our map pockets is going to require us to pull our door panel off. We're going to start with the mirror cover. Now we're going to remove our door cup. It's a great time to replace any of these parts if they have any damage. In our case, ours are in pretty good shape still. Now I'll remove the screw from the back of our armrest. And the last screw is the one for our speaker grill. Now we're going to remove the two 3 8 screws that hold our armrest to our door. Both of them should have these covers on. We're missing one of these, so we're going to replace them when we put the door panel back on. Get the other one off, slip a little pick underneath the corner, and pop it out. Once you remove the other hardware, the only thing holding our door panel to our door is going to be the door panel clips. We're going to start at the bottom, we'll pop the clips free and remove our panel. Slide up to release the metal tabs. Now we can remove our door panel, pull out and slowly slide it up. To remove our factory mat pocket, first we're going to do is pull our insulation back a little bit. There's probably going to be one staple in the corner here holding it on. So we get that out and we fold it back over. We just straighten out all these tabs. This is what hold the pocket to the door panel itself. Straighten out the factory tabs here. You want to keep these retainers and move them onto your new deletes. So we have all of our tabs straight, push down against the bottom here. Take off our old beat up mat pocket. If we have the pocket off, we'll give our door panel a quick cleanup. Our deletes come with a slightly different stock clip. We want to straighten all these out, and then we can install the clip in our door. Now we're ready to install our deletes. What we want to do is put the door panel off the edge of a table, and we can squeeze them and line them up with the holes. get it flat, you want to bend just the end tabs over to hold it in place. Then we can flip it over and bend up the rest. I'm going to push down and spread the tabs apart. one of our retainers on this end piece here. So the tabs are bent down, We're ready to reinstall our door panel. Slide around the door handle. Set that on the top and we'll start installing our door panel clips. We're going to 
reinstall our armrest. Install our new screw covers. I'll reinstall our door cup. And make sure you don't over tighten these, they can crack very easily. Just get it so it's snug. And our installation is finished. The matte pocket deletes made a huge improvement in our interior. Insulation wasn't too difficult to do either. Figure on about half an hour, maybe 45 minutes per side, so you'll be back on the road in no time.